Hello again everybody and welcome to Back to Basics Gaming. So, before we get back to the basics, let's just explain what we're doing here. We're playing the old Sega Genesis game, The Busy World of Richard Scary Busy Town. Now, obviously by looking at it, we can pretty much gather that it's, it's a kid's game. I played it when I was <laughs> 10 years old, so yeah, I was pretty... Actually, I was probably even older than that by the time I discovered it. Um, I tried to play it on the Sega channel in secrecy. I was caught, but it was simple and fun and just mindless stuff to just do. It was just kind of cool to look at, I guess. But this is this game. Uh, I guess it's based off a series of books, and I think they had a cartoon, something like that. I don't know all the details of it. So, And as you can also see right there, it says, most fun game ever. So, in 94, they knew that they had it. And it's funny to mention, too, that BusyTown actually has, like, a 4.7 on CoolRom.com. Yes, this is an emulator. I am playing on an emulator. This is the Gens emulator. Um, and that's pretty much it. I'm playing an emulator on my PC with a PS4 controller. That's the whole setup right there. And I'm using a Rock Band mic. It's a really really ghetto rigged operation that I got going on here until I can uh, afford to get some new equipment. So uh, alright let's check out our options and this isn't a review this is an actual let's play but um, the game is so simple so short that we'll be able to pretty much review it as well as just play it all in one run through here. Shining on? I don't know what the hell that even means. Off on off on I'll just leave it on I guess and then it has a standard sound test I don't know why I went in here expecting to see some sort of difficulty because there is not any of that so we'll go on ahead and start it up here we go oh, okay they're giving us credits I don't know why okay thanks alright so welcome to Disney King. climb on board the apple copter and fasten your seatbelt Move the mouse to pick the playground you want to visit. And okay. In the playground, you'll All right. a busy town character by simply moving the Yeah, mouse. as you can see, this game has voice work. Now, here's the whole deal. You can go to numerous different activities. This is how to play. I mean, you have to be really, really young kid or totally brain dead to not understand how this game works. So, we'll just kind of go in order here from uh, top to bottom. I suppose. So we're going to go over here to Captain Salty. Now it's funny because you land as the worm. I don't know what the worm's name is. But you play as the cat, I believe. Alright, so you can pretty much see where all this is going here. Alright, so we got the rudder. Okay, yeah, you just play the, as the crane operator, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. Take the rudder. Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be a great Let's Play, isn't it? A busy town. I wonder how many people actually have done this. I didn't even look online to see. It'd be awesome if I was the first one. Though I doubt it. The game pretty much just educates you, too. Tells you everything, that what everything does. That's the engine, really? This thing's smaller than hell. Uh, I guess it's just half an engine fuel need that sorry my emulator is kind of freaking out I got a weird setup here of using bandicam and oh, I don't know I just I don't like this setup at all okay so our radio Yeah, for whatever reason, I'm having a few hiccups on my emulator. Um, it is an emulator, so what do you expect? Compass? Yeah. Arr, matey. Or sonar. Or radar. Whatevs. Look at that sun. Look at that sun. He's like all stone looking. Yeah, man. This fucking gay pride looking boat right here, lifeboat. And I ain't got anything against gays, I'm just saying, look at it. Looks like gay pride colors. 
Is that the oven? The, oven? oven? the stove? It's the stove. Make some dinner. A flag. Gotta have that. Need a fucking crane to pick up this flag. Yeah, we really need that. Fucking pulling up cloth. Like, how is he even getting this shit in here? It's like the boat is cut in half. And there's already shit that's in there. Oh, okay, so we're delivering mail? Do they really do that by boat still? I thought that all that was done by airplane. Our luggage for our cruise, or... This is not a cruise, no. This is just our own personal stuff. Wouldn't you like to have that? Just be rocking that at the airport or getting on your cruise ship with checkered luggage? Oh, yeah, again, we really need to use this expensive heavy machinery to pick up this life preserver. Couldn't just have the swabby carry that up? Alright, so there you go. Captain Salty. Okay. Why are these guys doing everything the hard way? Parachuting down? This is the crew and they're parachuting down. I mean, why even bother with a boat if you already have an airplane? And they're not even getting on the boat. Where the hell are they going? You notice that, that the gay lifeboat is kind of sparkly? Sparkle, sparkle. It's a very, very flamboyant lifeboat. Alright, how many of these guys do we have to watch come down? This is ridiculous. I mean, the game didn't even say, hey, let's count them or anything like that. No, they just keep coming down. Why? Alright, already. It's enough. Are you... Do I have to do something? Oh! Oh, I'm an idiot. I don't know what I have to do. Do I have to aim them on the boat? Okay. Oh, I'm an idiot. Sparkle, sparkle. Okay, yeah, I know. I'm a dumbass. Great place for a nap. What a fucking bum! Alright, and then over here. Yeah, I'm a dumbass. I'm sorry. <laughs> that mouse was Mexican. Or is Mexican. Yeah, I missed. Alright, he's gonna... He's like a Russian. So you got a lazy ass, you got a Mexican, you got a Russian. Here's a captain. I like how the... I like how the captain is like the dumb sounding one. <laughs> the Italian guy's the chef. Uh huh. He's like Scotty from Star Trek. He's like an Irishman. Okay. Well, there you go. There's the crew. Uh, well done, crew. Sure. Wait a minute. Shouldn't, like, the captain be the one behind that wheel there? Because, like, the cat right here that I am, you know, going back and forth here, he's the captain, so why is that dude, like, at the wheel? I don't know. I don't know much about boats. Alright, what is this? Well done, crew. Whoa, I kind of sound like Popeye. Hoo -hoo. All right, I don't know what the hell I did there. What do I have to do? Oh, now you uh, hold the button down and paint. I think I might have skipped a part. I don't know. I seen a bunch of shiny objects. I don't know. I think he was supposed to inspect stuff. I have no idea. Who cares, right? <laughs> Obviously putting too much thought into this. Man, this is like the fastest paint job ever. Oh, this dude has it going on, man. Good for you. 
Alright, are we done? I don't know what else. It won't let me paint the rest of that red. Oh, down here? Here we go. There we go. Full steam ahead. Oh, busy town. And there you go. There's Captain Salty. Gives you a little animation, and you're off. Woohoo. Um, as far as education factor goes and everything like that, it's pretty ideal for a kid. I wouldn't mind my kid, um, you know, playing something like this. Alright, well, let's get on to... You know, this might actually turn into a couple videos now that I think about it, because I've already that segment already took a good amount of time, so we'll see how they go, and yeah, I think I'm going to have to space it out to at least two videos. Alright, so now over here, we're building the house. Okay. Yeah, see, here's the cat. This is the cat that I was thinking of. Okay, so yeah, pretty much what you got to do is Build the house, bring furniture in, stuff like that. It's pretty much the same thing as the boat, just like, you know, not on water. So this dude will give you what you need. Uh, excuse me, drinking some soda. Alright, so hold the button down, just like painting. What the hell? There we go. Boom, 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 boom. This mouse, or this cat is just like, he's an ace, man. He, he must like be part Pollock or something because he, he knows how to work, let me tell you. Alright. You just go all over the place, it really doesn't matter. You're not going to get in trouble for anything. I like how he puts the shingles over the, um, over the, uh, Chimney. God, man, I can't talk. Okay, I was missing that. Alright, now you bring all the other crap in. So, let's see what we got here. <laughs> so this guy wants you to bring a water heater into the house. Now, even though it may very well not have any water in it, let me tell you something. These water heaters, they're fucking heavy, okay? Especially ones this size. I mean, you know, these things are heavy. This dude is just... Look at this. He's swole as shit, man. Just... Wow. Good for him. Yeah, he's sweating. Yeah, no shit, dude. He just carried a water heater. Nuts. Cold water faucets. We'll take that. There you go. My cat is over here wanting attention, so you might hear her on the mic. Hot water, okay. Sink. Alright. Go up the stairs. I don't even think you need to go up the stairs. Yeah, look it. You could just, like, go wherever you want. Like, they didn't even restrict it. So you could just, like, magically... E yes, I see you. Alright, talking to my cat. Alright. This dude's gonna carry a washing machine, too. He's gonna get a fucking hernia at this rate. <sighs> I like how the game points it out, too. A furnace? Yeah, the furnace weighs a lot, too. Don't let me get off this fucking forklift and help you. Fuck that. I'd rather see you rip your nuts in half. Go ahead, try to lift a furnace on your own. See what happens. How great would it be if, like, the pig put one thing in and it was just this? Alright. More pipes. Let him know if it fits. Doesn't he mean let me know if it doesn't fit? the point of letting them know if it fits. The green, chair is very big. green chair is very big and I'm sure it's very heavy too, you lazy prick. Get up. I don't even know why I'm going up the stairs when you can just whoosh over this way. You know, he's just like standing on that pipe. Look at that. 
yet he goes down the stairs automatically. See, like, when he jumps back to the to the sidewalk, the computer does that automatically. Now I can just do this, like that. Okay, but see, the computer does that. Man, look at that TV. Look at the antennas on it. Have you ever seen a TV that looks like that in your life? I think that's it. Now, if memory serves me correct, I think we have to, like, test the stuff out. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Alright, so now we get to test everything out. So first off, we'll start down here with the water heater, or the furnace. Alright, furnace warms up the house. This'll get the shit stains out of our undies. This'll keep the water hot. Alright, what? Fucking, we don't want to educate on on the hot water tank? Really? Okay. This is where we wash our... Hey, where the hell is the toilet bowl anyways? Is he just pissing the sink here? This is where you wash your hands of urine. Yeah, this house is missing quite a few things, such as a stove as well. But okay. TV. Yeah, fish. Like, he's a cat, I guess he'd like that. There you go. I think that's it. No? What the hell else do you do? Oh, he can read. Alright. Now what? Hot water? Oh, no hot water. Okay, so we don't have hot water. Now this dude comes in and... I don't remember. Oh, he do it. <laughs> That'll be $500, please. So flip a switch, just like in real life. Okay. And it's funny too because I tried to inspect the hot water and the hot water tank and it wouldn't let me. Now I know why. Okay. Are we done? I guess that's it. Is there something that I haven't done yet? I tried going by the fireplace, but I don't want to do anything. So I think all you really do is just... Can you go on the roof? No. I guess all you do is just leave. Like, the, the other one, it kind of... It kind of ended, you know? Hey, you can't do anything. Alright, well, whatever. There you go, building a house. Oh, okay. I mean, like, w would I have been able to do that? I don't know. And here comes the new family. Well, there you go. You build a house and installed furniture in it and didn't see a fucking cent out of it. Alright. Well, I'll tell you what. Well, we're going to cut this one in half and then we'll do we'll do the rest so as always thanks for watching thanks for listening and uh thank you for helping me get back to the basics i know it's been a while but uh i'm back i can't say for how long or whatever but it's good to be back and we'll be playing some games and hopefully i'll be able to pump out some legitimate reviews as well we'll see you later